Okay, he's first. We can play one more pro game. Yay! 4-3 with shelters. Nothing funny going on. Let's take a look at the board. Attack, Swindler, and Rogue. Okay, defense, Moat. Hey, Moat! It's Moat, guys! Is it Moat? Yes, it is. It is totally Moat. Glad you asked. So, yeah, that's that's happening. What's the, What else is going on? Village here with Wandering Winder who is also in my chat, and he's a village in this game. Great! Prince is a village, and Native Village is also a village. Draw Council Room. Prince, Moat. Native Village, potentially. Okay, plus buy here's in Council Room. Yeah, it looks like all the things. Yeah, you can do tons of cool stuff, and Prince is okay for reliability. We do have the overpowered and broken Prince treasure map c -c combo Wait, is there trashing? Ugh. Yeah, I kind of whiffed on that one. There's no... There's no trashing. That's annoying. I mean, there's Wandering Winter for sifting, which is pretty good. You can decently, reliably put together two treasure maps. That's pretty good. Prince is great for reliability. You can Prince a freaking council room. No, no, can't. Nope, there are rules. Wander you can Prince Wandering Winter or like a moat. Or like a great hall, or like you prints all sorts of cool stuff. Uh, scavenger even actually, scavenger is really good. It's prints. Uh, but Swindler, uh, it's a swingy card. It's Swingler, and so I have to open with it. Do I get two of them to open? Well, there's shelters. I feel better about it because of that. I'm not gonna open Swindler Scavenger. That just seems worse than double Swindler. So is it double Swindler or Swindler Silver? Uh, uh, there's no trashing, but it's not an easy call. I wonder if you can, like, Wandering Winter discard things and then Native Village set them aside once you've done, once you're done drawing your deck. That could be kind of cool. Let's, let's let the allure of that guide me into opening Swindler Silver so I can build up to it as opposed to Double Swindler. I'm not really sure what to do. Oh yeah, and Shelters. That makes me want Swindler less. I want the Silver, though. Uh, now, uh, he's going to put his Swindler on top here. I'm getting Swindled next turn. Do I get a Moat? Uh, great Hall, Great Hall, Trashing Hovel is is super way better, right? Yeah, for sure, Zs. That's that's totally the play here. And this draw sucks. BT Dubs. Five. What do I get? Ooh, that's unfortunate for him. He had Collision. Chose not to play Swindler. Okay. Still haven't seen my Swindler. That's annoying. He gives me a council room. No villages in my deck. Do I want to go for that? I want it eventually. I've got a necro. Yeah. Yeah, let's go for this. Seems about right. I want to get some wandering winders. Uh, I'll totally be playing Swindler this turn. And picking up a wandering winder. Pretty much regardless. Unless I draw a necro, I guess. That would change things. Did not. Great. Uh, yeah, I gotta attack him. <sighs> That's annoying. You know, that's that's why people don't like Swindler right there. That's why people don't like that card. Just saying. Uh, Wandering Winter is a super important card. In fact, the split could end up being decently important. Although, I mean, Prince can function as an auxiliary village. But yeah, I gotta get a lot of these. Line up my actions. I, I really want to play a council room this turn. I don't think it's gonna happen, but... 
Oh, hey, look, council room, you are amazing, uh, but I don't want to draw you just yet. Totes amaze balls. Uh, okay, let's think for a minute before playing this Wandering Winder. Uh, it's totally an awful idea, right? Did I shuffle this turn? I did. I did. Discard silver, copper, copper, copper. Uh, yeah. Wait a second, but there's only four cards there? So I'm gonna... <laughs> Whatever, this doesn't matter, but... Yay, I did it. You get a purple. Play this Necro. Uh, council room, right? Yeah, council room. It's uh, it's a really good card. Unless I want Wandering Winter Moat. No, uh, I have to draw deck. Draw deck, get prints, draw more deck. Get reliability. I think that's how you win this game. I think Prince is just a rock star here, yeah? This is a great draw, by the way. I should be able to draw my deck. Because I brought that council room last turn like a freaking boss! So good at this game. Yeah, I can get away with not playing this council room here, because I just want to buy a prince. Uh, later I can pick up two T-maps to add payload after a princing thing, so that's good. Oh my... That's really irritating. Just want to say that. Thanks. Okay, this is fine. I should be able to set aside... Prince of Scavenger. Okay, that's not what he wanted to see. I mean, it's good, but he wanted to see Wandering Winter, and he didn't. So uh, I should be able to Prince either Wandering Winter or Great Hall this turn. Yeah, so I'll get my choice of things, which I need to decide now. Well, Wandering Winter's a better card. So I want to Prince it. Yeah means I don't get to play as many terminals? No, I'm still okay. Yeah? Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. How many Wandering Winters do I have? I have three. Ugh. Maybe I should have Prince the Great Hall. No, I'm still okay. Let's do this. Oh, you get a treasure map. Congratulations. And I'll pick up a Wandering Winder. And I, I'm actually really tempted by this native village thing. But the thing is, my payload is either terminal money or gold. Mm, I don't think this native village thing's going to work. I think I want to moat. Just keep on drawing cards. Cards are super good. And this is why Prince is amazing. I can uh, have a very good chance to draw my council room here. Well, that's annoying. Why does his swindler hit all of my... 
Ugh. I found all my action cards. <laughs> uh, do I give him a province? Uh, yeah. Sure. And then I get a Wandering Winter and a Rogue. I don't think it's time for treasure maps yet. But it, it probably will be. It may never be. I don't know. It depends on how the Rogues go. I want to attack him. He doesn't have a Necro, so the fact that that's gone is good for me. And also, uh, one of his Wandering Winters is gone, so he only has four villages in his whole deck, right? Is that right? Uh, granted, there's Prince, so that's additional villagesness. <laughs> yeah, so that's his whole deck, but he only has four villages, plus a, a Prince to play a Scavenger for free. Two native. Oh wait, yeah, native village is a village. I'm so good at this game. Yeah, terminals are not super limited. Let's play this card. Let's play that card. Now let's play this card. Rogue. Wandering Winder. Hey! Oh! You can have a, a dookie. Uh, so, I kind of want to, uh, Rogue's a great gainer right now because there's actually good stuff in the trash. There's this council room that I want and a treasure map that I kind of want. So I'm thinking Rogue treasure map and, uh, I've got plenty of terminal space, so moat? We can give the moat another chance, yeah? Rogue, T-map, moat. I should be drawing enough for that. And, and I'll, I'll get the council room out of the trash, yeah? That's pretty good. Let's do that. No, I don't want to look at the moat. Uh, this is pretty scary looking at this. Granted, I'm gonna probably get another council room played on me, and uh, this Wandering Winter draw, so I'm very likely... Come on, deck, don't screw me, please. That would just be awful. Okay, thanks, YTB. This is why Prince is a good card. Okay. Uh, this is safe. Uh, let's play some rogues. Let's make sure we draw. Okay, we can gain now T-map. 
I would really like to say the council room to draw golds. That's not going to happen. So we have to play it now. That stinks. But uh, whatever. Uh, this is what I want. You get an estate. And now with a million dollars, let's uh, let's talk about ending this game. How's it gonna end? Not soon. So another prince is probably a good idea. I would really like some reliability. I can prince a moat. I can prince a great hall. I could prince a scavenger. That would be super hot. I mean, I just start the turn with whatever I want. Uh, yeah, a uh, prince seems pretty good. Prince, scavenger. Great Hall, I guess. I'm not really sure that that was right. I'm actually okay with that. I just rogue the other rogue back, probably. And I got a duchy! Duchy's rule! He only has one council room in his deck, right? Can he draw it? His deck, I mean. I mean, he can draw the council room for sure. And what's his economy like? Oh, he stole my rogue. Well, poopy face. So I've got more payload. I might just green. It may be time. If I can print a good thing. Okie doke. This is fine. Oh, hello, Prince. You're looking very good. So, uh,. I could print Scavenger, which pretty much guarantees that I kick off every turn, right? Because I can play Scavenger first, top deck a council room, and then I play a Wandering Winder, and that's like super good. Uh, so I want that. That's what I'm printing. And then I think I, I just start greening, yeah? What is this? What does this do? What? That, I don't, what? Anyway, I, I need to not get distracted and put these cards back on my deck in any order I want. I played all my council rooms. I have to play this moat to draw my deck, yeah. Uh, let's play some attack cards on you, okay. Uh, I think you're gonna get I don't think I want to give you a duchy you can just have this rogue and then I can have that rogue yeah that's good rogue rogue uh, let me just double check. What's in my discard? Curse. Copper, copper, ogie. Yeah, we're totally not triggering that shuffle. I mean, it doesn't really matter, but let's just not do it. Because I, I have very little to gain and an 
unnecessary risk. So uh, double province and council room, I think, is what we need. Yeah. Double province, council room. Yeah, that's that's super good. Let's just win the game now. That's annoying, but that's why I got the council room. He has, he has to give me a rogue, which isn't the best, because I can just rogue the council room back at some point if I really need to. I have a lot of Wandering Winders. So, like, early Swindler hits were mildly unfortunate, but I think me hitting his Wandering Winder and his Necro it was super... And I got a, one of his Princes, which probably set him a whole turn behind, yeah? So, it's possible... Oh, he's getting T-maps. Yeah, that's, that's pretty good. If he can draw it. draw those golds or is he top decking them oh that's not what he wanted so he's gonna have a rough time next turn now granted double province is a strong play for him but uh He's unlikely to kick off next turn. I'm going to have some careful thinking to do if I can't triple province. I should be able to triple province. I should have no problem with that. My deck can handle it. nothing in the trash I want so we're not gonna play rogue uh, I wanted to draw that thanks deck uh, this is uh, potentially very bad eight eight and three crap I can't win if I'd drawn goals instead of green cards, I'd be winning right now, but now it's very dangerous. For him to kick off next turn, that one card that he drew has to be some kind of village. If he kicks off next turn, do I just lose? No, I have to duchy dance, and that's sad. I don't want treasure maps in my deck, so playing these rogues is not good. Uh, let's play Swindler first, see what happens. Oh, you get a purple. Lovely. How many duchies can I get without playing rogues? I'll have 17. I can get three duchies. That's probably just the smart thing to do. Get three duchies in a moat and not play any rogues. I want to be able to draw all of my draw all of my treasure. Man, he hit that council room. Oh, that was just a really bad turn of luck. What about two duchies council room moat? Is that better? I think that might be better, because I, I can triple province, my deck has it in it, so let's just, and, and when I do that I win, so let's just get a, some more draw, yeah, 
I think that's the right play. Oh, I can't count. Well, the moat's not really necessary. It would be nice, but whatevs. Doesn't change the fact that that's the play to make. Okay, that's great. Okay, one buy, right? Of course, Goko will never let me know. But yeah, one buy is what needed to happen. So all I need to do is double province. Council room, please. Let's get the most out of our sifting effect here. Double province. Can I do it now? No, let's play moat. <laughs> I love discarding like all my treasures. That's that's wandering winder for you. That's what it do. Yeah, I've got it now, right? Yeah, that's plenty. And it wins, yes. GG. Great haul. And a copper. Oh well, I feel like all the games we've played so far have been pretty high skill. Granted, this one was high variance as well, but there was some thinking involved, you know? <laughs> 